This lesson will cover the following topics. Exhaust gas recirculation. The exhaust gas recirculation, or EGR, function is used to reduce the nitrogen oxide content of the exhaust gases. This function uses the following components. The coolant temperature sensor, the engine flywheel sensor, the accelerator pedal position sensor, the exhaust gas recirculation valve, and the exhaust gas recirculation valve position sensor. Nitrogen oxides present in the exhaust gases are caused by a high combustion temperature. The EGR valve is controlled by a modulated pulse current, RCO. By sending exhaust gases which have already been burnt back into the inlet manifold, the quantity of oxygen involved in combustion is reduced. The combustion temperature is therefore lower. The EGR valve may appear in the following forms. As a valve activated by an electromagnet, or as a valve activated by an electric motor. The conditions generally required to enable exhaust gas recirculation are as follows. Warm engine. Engine at an average speed. And the accelerator pedal position at an average load. Depending on the various parameters, the computer determines the required rate of recirculation. The computer controls the EGR valve. The EGR valve position sensor transmits the true position of the EGR valve. The computer can adjust the valve control. Any fault on the exhaust gas recirculation function components will inhibit the function. Fitted after the air filter, the flow meter measures the mass of clean air taken in by the engine. This information allows the computer to manage the quantity of exhaust gas entering to provide the best rate of recirculation. Vehicles not equipped with a flow meter have an air temperature sensor. This information, linked to the turbocharging pressure, allows the computer to calculate the mass of air entering. Some EGR circuits have a recycled gas cooling element. The recycled gas is passed through an exchanger cooled by the engine cooling circuit. The reduction in the temperature of the recycled gases has the benefit of reducing the quantity of nitrogen oxide. Some systems use a bypass valve. Depending on the temperature conditions, this valve directs the recycled gases through the cooler or straight to the inlet manifold. During the period when the engine temperature is rising, the recycled gases are not cooled. In fact, the increased temperature of the recycled gases speeds up the engine's warming up. Once the temperature limit is reached, the gases pass through the cooler. The bypass valve is activated pneumatically via a solenoid valve controlled by the injection computer. In this section, we covered the following points. The exhaust gas recirculation, or EGR, function is used to reduce the nitrogen oxide content of the exhaust gases. The nitrogen oxide present in the exhaust gases is caused by a high combustion temperature. Exhaust gas recirculation is activated under certain conditions. The EGR valve position sensor transmits the true position of the EGR valve. Any fault on the exhaust gas recirculation function components will inhibit the function. The flow meter manages the quantity of exhaust gas entering to provide the best rate of recirculation. Some EGR circuits have a recycled gas cooling element. A bypass valve directs the recycled gases through the cooler or straight to the inlet manifold.